Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another episode on Sky Factory. And today we're going to be working on, well, I don't know. Uh, the reason why I say that is because I kind of looked over um, the next couple of things that I do want to do. And there's not really one thing I want to do is because I kind of want to now focus on end goals. Uh, with that being said, we got to start kind of building like our base. Uh, we got to start building like little farms, little machines here and there. So I can't really just do one thing per episode now. Uh, I kind of, I have a small list of things that I want to do for my end goals. So some of the, the end goals are um, obviously a better armor. So I need some sort of power suit slash at least better flight for now. Um, and then uh, what else do I have? I have a nether star generator. So that's going to be our main power source. Uh, I've never actually made like a wither killing farm before. So that would be useful. Uh, it's probably going to be similar to the one that was um, on uh, Azuma Void. But I'm going to be doing my own style. Um, and it's it's just going to be different, I guess. Um, and I don't think we had Draconic Evolution in that pack. So I'll be using a grinder to kill the mob. So it, it will be easier to to get the, the, the withers. Um, and then the ultimate furnace. Oh my goodness. Um, furnace. This thing, uh, obviously active is nothing. But this thing, once you build it, it instant smelts anything with basic coal it's like oh my god it's amazing um i'll be doing this ultimate furnace for any of my automating ores machines so if i build one machine i'm gonna build one of these it's it's crazy it, it, it's it's just crazy how it works um so i'll be doing that and automation just just straight up automating ores um anything like that you know if i need to um basically what i had downstairs that's automation but not to like the max ability of what it can do i can go faster i can build stronger no just just faster <laughs> can't go any i don't think stronger would be i think fast faster is the only way to go um so yeah that's kind of just the way the things go um and also i guess an emmy no see i have an emmy system but um emmy an emmy system um with like automation with that that's also going to be one of the kind of goals as well it's not going to be a goal it's just something i'm going to be have to do unless i want to do everything by hand it's not going to be fun but yeah so kind of with that being said um i kind of told you guys what i want to do um also Last episode, we did the Emmy system. I made some extra drives, and I threw in all of my inventories items here. So, uh, no, I think it's just jerky. Yes, I need all of that. So, I... So, yeah, I did that. Um, and part of these end goals, we're going to be doing what I'm calling or dubbing the... 8 core CPU. That's going to be like my main central for this base. And with that, it basically means it's going to be an ME system with 8 cores. Um, so I've created like a star design in my head. And then I'm, I'm just going to max it out with like um, assemblers and crafting storage units and CPUs and it's going to be pretty cool. So that's going to be like a main goal um, of what we want to do. I'm going to centralize it around our, our first spawn point. And I hope I hope it doesn't like... Uh, what's my Y? It's, it's 84. I hope it doesn't do anything with the system. Uh, I, I can try and kill myself and see where it drops me. Because I'm pretty sure it should put me right here. It should drop right there. But... That's, I guess, fine. Um, uh, let me see something. I can get grass seeds, right? Oh, what What did I press? Grass seeds. Okay, I have grass seeds, so I don't need these the, the, the grass. I have a shovel. Let's grab the shovel. So, like I said, this main 
area right here is going to be the, the I guess, the future stage. I'm probably going to build it up there and to that level. And let's grab some of the other stuff that I won't be using. And let's just block this off. We're going to make this flat. I'm going to get, I'm going to clear this area up. So this will be our central point. Uh, let's see. I got some stone. I got more cobblestone. And the other thing is we're going to be doing... Um, no, I guess that's not really... Not needed. It's just more of a, an idea. But um, I'm going to be using deep storage units for single base item storage. Uh, for example, cobblestone. I, or, or if I don't need to link it to something, I think ingots will be deep storage units. But something like cobblestone, gravel, sand, things that are used for machines, I'm going to B space them. Um, if you don't know what B space encapsulating, it it allows you to tune barrels, multiple barrels together, so it links them. Um, and it also sh it basically they share quantity uh, inventories, so it's really useful if you just need straight cobblestone or um, I guess gravel and sand. I think those are the three main thing I'll be doing right away. Um, and then in this ME system, it will show cobblestone, and then it'll show how many pieces you have, and that's it. So it's kind of cool. Uh, that's obviously, you know, something later game, but for now, I'm just kind of letting you know what the deal is and, and we're going to be doing this like in the center too, which is, you know, so far the base is based on the central part of this base. So let's get rid of all these. Goodbye water source, and we should build a reservoir as well, I guess. Reservoir is basically uh, a, a water source. Uh, it's your water source. And then I can, even if I wanted to, I can dump that water source into, um, oh, whatchamacallit, uh, into like a drum. And then the drum, it, it, can, it can link to an ender tank, and then the ender tank just goes anywhere it wants. Um, reservoir, reservoir, res, res, reservoir. So, okay, I'm missing the middle. What's the middle? I don't have this. Uh, quartz. What was it? Let's see. So another thing is power. Power, um, obviously we can't go straight to the nether uh, star generator. It takes, you need to kill 64, um, like at least for the generator. I'll, I'll show you. Nether star. This, this requires eight, and then that requires eight, and that requires one. So I did the math, it's about 64, probably why the multiplier is 64. And that multiply or this requires one nether star so that means basically means i have to kill 64 withers to get another star and then i think i need to kill uh a grinder uh so that's 65 and i think that's it just 65 withers to get a grinder <laughs> it's crazy okay let's take all these out uh is it that no alloys only that should be finishing the stone stone yep and then okay um hopefully this is the right quartz and uh, there's nothing there uh is it this one? No. 
No, because that's that's just a simple shit. I need this. No. I need that. No. What the hell do I need again? Fused quartz. Alloy smelter. Well, it's not a furnace. It's alloys. Uh. Oh, it's four? Is that what I need? I need a lot more of that. Do I have any nearby? So, yeah, like I said, the next couple of episodes are going to be so random. It, it's it's not going to be anywhere close to what I was just doing for the past couple of episodes. Just because I, I, I'm i probably going to need one thing, and then I'm going to need this thing, and then I'm going to want to do that, and then I want to do that. So that's kind of how that's going to go. Okay, let's hope this does the right thing now. This is the only thing I hate about the alloy smelter is that because it has so much, it, it has multiple options. It would be cool if you could select, like, let's say there's more, like right now there's multiple options that I can do. Like if this thing gives me more pure nether quartz again, oh, I'm going to be pissed. What can I do with this? Okay, I can do block. No, that's not even going to be helpful. Okay, that's, that's useful, I guess. I can use it for something. Thank you. And that will make two, which I need four. So I'll need the next little bit here once it's done. Go here. And I need to also make um, reservoir. I always do O for some reason. I also need to make this. I have no iron. Holy crap. So the, again, this is why you need to crank up. Uh, this is why you have to create like an Emmy system that has everything in it. And I just realized my, my thing down here went away. Nope. There we go. Okay. Oh, shit. This. We'll need, need two. Okay. And put that there. It's done. And put this here. One. Glass. Come on. Sand. And, and we're going to have to make some pulverizers. I'm going to have to do... Like, I'm going to have to start up the, the main B-Space, like, setup. And that's, like, you know, get three pulverizers. No. Would it be three pulverizers? I guess? I don't know. I don't know how I would set it up, to be honest. I just need to output gravel. I, I guess cobblestone, gravel, and sand. That's all I really need. To have, like... You know, a system set up. Okay, so I need a hammer. And then we're going to bust out some of this. And let me get a wand real quick. Really? Shit. I need to make a new wand. Let's see, can I make that? Sweet. I need something that goes up. Let's do this. Hammer. Okay, there, we got sand. See, and then now we only want furnace only. 
and then we want to pump out some glass that way. That's why I said that this with this furnace, it'd be kind of cool if you could see what you're going to get before it actually smelts, you know. Because then you'd be like, oh yeah, yeah, that's what I want. Because I know you can get, like, something else with that. It's stupid. So I got two. I need three more. Perfect. And I'll leave, let that run. Because eventually we're probably going to need more of it. And there. There's our second reservoir. Um, it's raining again. Oh, look at that. I'm not really sh I don't... It, not, it doesn't need to be picky on where I put this. So I'm just going to lay that right here. Uh, let's see. Can that work? Maybe on top? Nope. Okay. Bucket. Grab one of that. One, two, and then now it's full. Get her pick. So what this will do now is that we can ultimately get unlimited water from this. And I, I can't even put it back in. Okay, so that's going to have to go back in. And I'll put all this stuff there and there. Okay, so there we go. It's still more stuff. Guess I'll grab this. Do, do, do. Get rid of all the water because we don't need it. Um. Let me do this. It, there we go. Get rid of that. Okay, so pick. And also, I'm going to have to make a magnet. Because if we're going to start doing all this building, uh, we're pr I'm probably going to want a magnet. So we might, I might look into that um, next episode for sure. Get the materials for that. And then that's, you know, this is this is how you, you normally play, you know. This is almost modded when you get to that point. Yeah, I, f I just forgot about that. And I actually didn't have that much. I'm surprised. And there's our mossy cobblestone from from when our when we had the barrels. Now that it's funny. I've always wondered how to get mossy, but because you can use the chisel to get the mossy, it was kind of like a good trick to get mossy. Because sometimes you needed mossy for other stuff. Uh, was that not a half slab? That was not a half slab. That's a half slab. Okay. Torches. Probably don't need any, to be honest. Because everything's half slab ready. But there we go. Um, oh yeah, just this stuff now. Let me go throw all this stuff in our system. Uh, I really, I really need an import chest. There we go. Because it, it, it takes too long to import that stuff, and I hate it. Uh, I didn't pick it all up. So some of my drives are getting full. Oh, oh wow, we have one drive that's not even touched. So all these ores, um, again, that's going to be... Um, I guess... See, most of these ores too, I'm just going to just throw them all out if I can't do anything with it. Because, like I said, um, when you automate it, you don't necessarily need to make... You don't have to go down the list of ores. You could just go gravel, smelt, or sieve it, and then there you go. You're done. Unless you want the other stuff that goes with uh, your secondaries, uh, then you're going to want to do all of them. Like, that's why I have all three of them running right now. Because look at all the extra stuff you get. You get the agent spores, you get the cactus seeds, you get the lorium dust, which is big reactors. I'm not going to go into that. I just don't feel confident in making a reactor. Uh, Quicksilver drop, I don't know what that is. 
um, exotic seeds. So you get all this like like redstone, bone meal, blaze powder, glowstone. That's why I'm doing this all early game. I do actually have to empty all this out because the machine's not running. That's okay. And I'll just empty this out now. So that's basically why I'm running all three of them early game. Late game, my machines won't, it won't have that at all. They won't need them. So let's put all this stuff around. And I just found something new. I can hold shift and just drag my mouse. That's cool. Hard drives are still looking good. So the one thing about my, the CPU thing that I do want to start building, or at least the design for sure, is the power. I tried powering this with this wheel it doesn't work it doesn't work at all so i think it needs more power and without get jumping to the nether star generator i'm gonna have to indulge in lava generating so kind of like the same concept that i did before with the crucibles lava the pyro theory pyroethium all that setup i'm gonna have to do that soon so um if you saw i was looking at portals i'm thinking i might go make it in the portal of the last millennium just because I didn't go there last time and build anything. It's a nice void world. Um, so void is good. Although the nether also has void. But the the um, zombie pigmen get annoying. I built there before. Platforms. Doesn't matter how much light you have. They spawn. It's stupid. I don't like it. Um, so I don't have a bed installed. So I can't go to sleep. So I'm just going to. Actually it's almost going to be day again. So that's a good time to end off the video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, next episode, I'm going to just, again, continue building what I want to do for the end game goals. And see what we build. So if you want to see what I build next time, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not a subscriber. If you are already a subscriber, thank you for subscribing. Um, if you want to stay updated with the channel, make sure to hit, check out the description for my media links. Social media links. So if you want to follow there, please do. Um, but yeah, guys, the, this is going to be it for another Scott Factory episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm DJPartisan9, and I'll see you guys in another video. I'm out!